Keithley's Kickstart software is an excellent tool for test automation and data collection. Let's take a look at the graph tools Kickstart provides to analyze your test data faster. Here we have an example of a data logger test where we have measured the temperature on the first three channels. The data is shown in the built-in graph, which is great for monitoring data collection in real time as well as trends in the data. Click and hold the graph with the left mouse button to scroll to different areas. Place the mouse cursor to a point on the graph and scroll the mouse wheel to zoom in. Double click the graph to quickly return to the full data set. When the mouse is active in the graph area, two buttons will appear in the lower right hand corner. The top button is the box zoom button, which allows you to select a section of the graph to zoom into. The lower button auto scales the graph to show all of the data. Each axis on the graph can be controlled individually with features that become visible by hovering over the axis area on the graph. The minimum and maximum values for the axis can be manually set by typing in the desired value and pressing enter. Any set values can be reset by clicking the auto scale button. Both axes can be set to use linear or logarithmic scales and the X axis can be set to use time or any of the other measured data. Hovering over the top of the graph, a title can be added to label your test. In the top right corner, we see the legend for the graph. Hovering over the legend expands it to show the full features. Here we can edit the colors used for the data and control what data is graphed by selecting or deselecting the checkboxes on the left. The summation buttons on the right control the quick statistics for that data series. Clicking the statistics displays common calculations on the data. These calculations are for the whole data set. As we will see later, we also have the option to select a section of the data. Note that the max and min values are displayed as points on the graph, whereas the rest of the statistics are displayed together in a general box. Any of these values can be disabled by hovering over the statistics box and selecting the eye icon. This keeps the graph easy to read by only displaying the data most useful to your application. Both the statistics box and the legend can be dragged to different locations in the graph to ensure that the most important data is always visible. If you're interested in a specific point of data, perhaps to reference back to the table, simply hover over the desired series on the graph. As the mouse cursor moves over specific points, the XY coordinate as well as the table row number is displayed on the graph. Points of interest can be marked on the graph by clicking the point. This locks the label in the visible state. Clicking again unlocks it so that it automatically disappears. Kickstart also provides the ability to use cursors to compare multiple points in the graph. Right click in the graph area to enable the first cursor. As shown, the cursor can be dragged and anchored to any point on the graph and the equivalent points in the other data series are also highlighted. Right click again to enable the second cursor, which duplicates the first one and also shows the difference between the two on the X axis. We can go a step further and re-enable the statistics for a specific series of data. The displayed statistics now only apply to the data selected by the cursors. The cursors can be removed from the graph by right-clicking over the cursor and selecting Remove Cursor. The Kickstart graph has the power to graph multiple things at once. Take for example this test where we measured one channel of temperature, one channel of resistance, and one channel of DC voltage. Kickstart automatically creates a separate graph for each type of measurement made. The axes on the graph are controlled independently, as are the statistics for each series. A graph can be hidden from view by deselecting the measurement function checkbox in the legend. Multiple runs of an app can be displayed on the same graph by selecting them in the run history. As before, an entire run can be disabled from the graph by just selecting the checkbox in the legend so that comparing multiple runs is quick and easy. For applications using more than one instrument, multiple apps can be compared side by side, keeping all of your data in view. At any point in time, you can quickly save a screenshot of the graph to your PC or copy the graph for placement in a report by right-clicking on the graph area and selecting Save As Image or Copy to Clipboard. All visible aspects of the graph will be saved in the screenshot. For more information about Kickstart and all of the tools it provides to make your data analysis faster, please visit tech.com backslash Keithley dash Kickstart. Thanks for watching.